They finished because they were second to begin the day. As the 100 IM, our next event on the pool deck, and we heard from David Marsh before, Beryl Gastadello battling COVID-19 just a handful of weeks ago, and that's one of the reasons uh, answers our question of uh, why we haven't seen her in as many events, just slowly but surely getting back at it. We know that when she is on her game, she could do so much. It, and, and that's what Lenny Kreselberg told Mark Foster earlier. She's just one swim away. It, if she could just kind of find the feel for the water and having being sick with COVID really can tear you apart in so many ways. And especially when you come back and try to develop a feel. And that might take weeks to do that. Fortunately, LA has some room to breathe here, having two second place finishes. And if she can just kind of find her way during the regular season, Bernie, yep. and once she gets to the playoff, I think you're going to see a completely different barrel of Gaspadello. But again, uh, out of the 10 teams in the International Swimming League, six of them automatically move on. But eight will be there in the Netherlands in November as Anastasia Gorbenko comes in. Our teammate Beryl Gastadella has won this event three times. Luis Hansen has won at a time. Now watch Luis Hansen slide. She will be out like a bandit. She was 54-8 on her relay yesterday in the medley. Huge difference maker, Luis Hansen, right there in lane four in the middle for Toronto. But you can see how big this event can be for LA when everybody is healthy, because certainly Beryl Gastadello has all sorts of speed. She is the ISL record holder in this event. Yeah, again, I, I still think every race she does is going to help her. Every time she gets in the pool and does something like this, She'll get better and better. She's third right there, Gorbanko having that lead, which is good news for Gorbanko because she's got a great breaststroke. Freestyle probably even with Luis Hansen. And right now, LA over the far left, looking good right now, running one, two. A chance for a one, two finish. Gorbanko turns first, but expect Daryl Gastadello to come blazing home. Gorbanko trying to hold on for the win. Her teammate battling for first. No matter what it comes, it is big for the current as they've got another win here on day two. This time it's Gorbanko getting her first ever 100 IM win. The, the best news there for Coach Marsh and the LA Current was not Gorbanko because that was expected. It was Gastadello at 58-2. All of a sudden, you start to see that change in her stroke, riding a little higher in the water, swimming with a little bit more confidence. And I like the way Gastadello's starting to look, and she's got the skins at the end. And the current pick up six more points.